What's up you guys? Welcome back to my channel. For today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys how I create this mermaid crimped hair. <laughs> I'm not going to show you step by step because it's going to take way too long. So I'm pretty much just going to speak to you and give you some tips and tricks and also show you what I use to create this look. Uh, I posted, I want to say like three pictures already, like two or three pictures already with this hairdo and I always get DMs of people asking what I do to it, how I do it, is it my natural hair, is it not my natural hair, it's not my natural hair, my natural hair is actually just blah. It's not curly, it's not straight, it's not, I want to say it's a little bit on the wavy side, um, but it's definitely not this and I really wish it was this. Um, my inspiration for this is always like the mermaid vibes like i love mermaids and i'm like i want mermaid hair always and forever and then also my best friend gabby has like super wild curly hair and i'm like oh my gosh i love it she looks so awesome i've seen a couple of people do the little like hair crimping with like the big ones like the big barrels and it usually looks just like wavy and i remember thinking i want something that's gonna make my hair look like i just woke up and got out of bed and I also want something that's gonna make me look like I slept and breathed. So I found this one. It's literally like super cheap and like really good to be honest. You can find this anywhere. A few people buy it on, off of Amazon. I was just walking around through Ulta and I saw this. It's the bed head a wave we go <laughs> um, and from my understanding you can actually create a lot of different waves with this you can do like thicker waves or like uh, tighter waves depending on the setting that you have it in like the uh, heat setting um, I always just put it in like extra high hot 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 uh, and then I don't even leave it in my hair for a long time I go like this and then I like go straight down so how I do the hair crimping. Um, I like to section off my hair. So I just start with like this one. I don't like to do it by small pieces or small sections because the smaller the section, the tighter the crimp. And I don't like that look either because then you look like you have a huge like, whoa, like static. Like this thing is like wild, wild. And I, some people can rock it. I cannot <laughs> rock that hair. Um, so I just wanted something that's gonna be a little bit more subtle and wild but not like super like making my hair look like it's out of control um so i like to use like big chunks i like to section my hair in big chunks so i'll start off with like parting like this much and then i'll go ahead and i'll start like crimping it all the way down then i'll go to like the next chunk and start crimping it and then um when i get up here i just pretty much go i'm just gonna show you it's not on but like up here i'll like like hold on to it like that and then like go straight down and then go straight down and so on and then I go like this and that's it it's not complicated y'all that's it we're done uh, but really the other thing I think makes such a huge difference is this next step I use this gasu it's a gasu I'm assuming it's gasu and I'm going to say it like that Every part of me wants to say Jisoo because it sounds fancy like that, but I think it's Jisoo. Anyway, I like to use this product. It's honey infused hair oil. Uh, pretty much it's honey infused. I'm actually going to put a little bit on right now. As you can see, like I like to use this. I mean, obviously we're not like almost done with it or anything because I just got this a couple months ago, but a little bit goes a long way. Um, and I've actually been using this nonstop. So... What you should do is you get a little bit, right? Normally you would get the drops, but what I like to do in order to use all the product is I actually like to grab it and instead of squeezing the drops, I like to get what's like around it and like I get that and I'll do like one little extra drop and that's it. And this is so healthy for your hair, you guys. So you warm it up in your hands my hair look wild wild today so you warm it up in your hands and then you just go all the way down and you just put it all over your hair and it makes your hair so shiny and it smells like honey and you feel so refreshed and so good and there's a billion ways to use this product. 
um, but I specifically love using it right after I do something to my hair, right after I straighten my hair, right, right after I curl my hair, after I crimp my hair. It really makes such a difference. But that's it, y'all. I know y'all thought it was gonna be more complicated than this, but it is not. It is actually the easiest thing to do. And you can do it anywhere and at any moment. I know it looks wild and normally it actually doesn't look like this. It looks a little bit more put together on a normal day, but this is like three day hair <laughs> and I slept in it. So all the waves are like, so that is pretty much it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you guys did enjoy, go ahead and give it a thumbs up. If you have any questions or any suggestions of what you want to see next, don't forget to leave a comment down in the comments below. I said that so wrong, but you know what I mean. Uh, if you're new to my channel, hello, my name is Caroline. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, go ahead and check out my other videos and don't forget to subscribe. Um, and that's it, I love you guys. I will see you guys in my next video. Mwah. Bye.